Hi, welcome to the Eastern Township School Board series of videos. In this module, we're going to be looking at recording inside of Zoom, part of the Introduction to Technologies for Learning course. So here's the gist about recording. So when you attend online class, the sessions may be recorded. Uh, we can include your voice, your image. Uh, this recording may be shared to other teachers or other students for evaluation purposes or for basically filming a class and making it available. If you don't want to be recorded, either your image or your sound or both, it is your responsibility to disable the camera or let us know. Now, you will be informed before a session is recorded if we have to record you. Um, you, however, are not allowed to record any student or teacher without our consent, um, either directly from the computer or from a mobile phone or any recording device. So we are pretty strict on that as this is a school environment. Now, the other thing you can do in here, if you do want to record it, you just click the record button. Now you do have to ask for permission on about that. So you have to ask the host to give you permission to record. So once you have the permission, then clicking on record will actually record. Um, basically, what I suggest you could do for that is when a teacher is actually one on one, say in a breakout room and they're giving you an answer, uh, you might ask permission to record that answer. And by clicking the record button, you'll see two little buttons that will appear here a pause and a restart button. So you can actually pause it and start recording again. When you are done recording, you can click on that stop button. And then when you're when you're done the Zoom uh, class or the Zoom meeting, when you click leave, it will actually save the file. It will actually ask you where you want to save it, what you want to call it. And you can click save and it's actually going to save it. That might take a few minutes depending on the length of the um, recording, or it might take a few seconds if you only recorded a quick answer. So there you have it, the do's and don'ts of recording.